I just got my nails done. Hi guys, today is day seven of our Japan trip. Today is actually raining, pouring, so we had to run into a little shop and get this here plastic umbrella. But we're currently back in Harajuku because we're gonna try this new coffee place for breakfast. It's called Noa Coffee, N-O-A Coffee. Pictures look really cute, really good. So let's go, it's just right here. So we made it into Noah's Coffee. And the reason why we came was because I saw that they had this really interesting morning set. Look at that, there's set A, B. So I guess you could either have a toast or a waffle. And then they give you eggs and then there's also some coffee you can get. So that's really cute. And they have a lot of other food too. Let's see, wow. They have an apple parfait. Oh, look at all that waffle stuff. Oh. And one thing I love to, like I mentioned a lot about Japanese desserts, is like they're not sweet. So I just don't even feel that guilty when I am eating so much sweets here. <laughs> Anyways, let's get ordering. I ordered the uh, green tea latte. It, no, not just any green tea latte. It's roasted. I have never seen a roasted green tea latte yet here. So this is what it looks like. I love that they give so much foam. How come it's not green? That would be green. I don't know. Oh, I guess green tea is different than matcha. Ooh. Oh yeah, it's not like matcha, it's green tea. Different. I got an iced coffee, which you can see, you can put your own uh, cream and sugar. So, doing that shortly. So I got the ham and egg sandwich. I like how they cut it to like really cute squares and rectangles, you know? So delicately sliced. Mm. Which one's better today or yesterday? So yesterday I didn't get it with ham. I think I like the other one, the one yesterday, because they like toasted the bread and that makes such a difference because it's all crunchy. This one's more soft bread. It's still good. All right, here's the apple cinnamon honey waffle. It's got ice cream, it's got apple slices, honey, cinnamon. It's really good. I just got my nails done. I did some amazing shopping and I am a happy camper right now. Hi guys, welcome to day eight of our Japanese vlog. I love my outfits. I'm so poofy. Poofy bear. Today we're going to be visiting the Imperial Palace in Tokyo. It's like autumn in Japan. This is the little moat that connects to the Imperial Palace over there on the left side. That is the Imperial Palace, boys and girls. This is where the Emperor lives, or the Imperial family lives as of today. So basically, the capital used to be in Kyoto, but after the Shogun was overthrown, 
they moved the capital to Tokyo right here. And actually, the palace was destroyed after World War II, but they were able to rebuild it exactly afterwards. There are many gardens to walk around here, and no one is allowed to go inside the Imperial Palace except for two days, which is January 2nd, which is like a New Year's Day celebration. And then I believe it's February 23rd because it's the emperor's birthday. So basically on those two days, I believe the imperial family will come out to maybe greet some of the guests. But other than that, there's tours you can take of the imperial palace and the outsides. They have in Japanese and English. So you would have to go on the website to book a tour if you want to do that. But today we're just taking a stroll by ourselves, walking around, taking some pictures, looking at some gardens and just enjoying Japan. Yay. What kind of trees are those? They're like pine trees. Pine trees. Mm. But they're just like cut in a certain way, you know? Mm -hmm. I would love, but there is the sun. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hubby and I felt really tired, so we decided to get a Thai massage that's close by to our hotel. So we're out dressed and we're like sitting on mats. <laughs> like this. How do you feel? It's gonna be so nice. We're gonna feel so relaxed. We've been walking a lot and our legs are sore. So we're gonna get a two hour Thai massage. We just came out from the Thai massage. We got like a two hour king <laughs> special massage with the head and neck and body and oil massage. Ah, oh, we so sleepy. Felt oh, no. so good. How you feel? Good, good, good. The masseuses were very nice. They were very good and uh, very relaxing. Mm -hmm. uh, I've never had a Thai massage before, so it was an interesting experience with all the stretching. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that, that's very different because in normal massages, they don't do that. But... And by normal, you mean like a Swedish massage? Yeah, mm -hmm. Swedish. But wow, they will stretch you to another level. <laughs> but it's good, it's yeah. good. 